Thank you. Do some stuff. And some fertilizing. And some transporting. Yeah, I fertilized before the stream. That's gross. I uh, don't know if we get like a vehicle or something. What do you reckon we just like stand on the road and like just jack this full? Yeah. Oh, savage. Get out. <laughs> Give me your clothes. Give me your clothes, your boots, and your motorcycle. God damn it. No. Well, Jim Jams, you know, there was, there was a message that went out to, to, to if you wanted to join. Yeah, if you just start your PlayStation up. Start out. He, he was simulator. playing GTA Sport. What the fuck is that? It's a real reason for the lockdown, guys. It wasn't for, uh, you know, the pandemic that was happening. It was because the government needed to change all the batteries on their drones, yeah, aka that birds. Oh, it's pretty stimulating, yes. Lisa. It's pretty stimulating. Yeah. All right, you can go. I give, I give way. I'm I give games. way to beef I'm like five years old. Oh, and while you're giving way, do you want to use your pipe to empty your seed into my trailer? I sure do. As soon as the lag fucking <laughs> chills the fuck out. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Um, there is a tutorial that we did not do, Mac. Yeah. 100%. <laughs> <laughs> Beat technology. I'm trying to chop the fat beats. Non fatal says you stink, by the way. Oh, that's good. Oh, fuck, I'm calling on something. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> this is perfect. This is perfect. I don't have my trucker's lesson. Uh, but it looks like we're going to be playing this a bit. I think that's lag. I think I'm not, I'm not actually hitting things. I'm just lagging out. Signs and. Oh, God. <laughs> I'm hitting stuff and I'm lagging. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> it takes a lot for me to like change from reversing to going forward. Oh god. Oh god. Lag, lag. Oh god. <laughs> I'm sorry. I fucked up your fields. It was lag. Mm -hmm. Oh god. <laughs> Half of things. Yeah, the wobble mech. So it's the lag accompanied with this is not. It's not handle like you would expect. Oh, like, like, oh god! <laughs> oh my god! I fucking hit a tree because of the leg. Oh my god, how do people do this in real life for like a living? Oh gosh. Oh uh, no. Oh god, don't collide. We don't need that. <laughs> We're colliding. No. <laughs> Slow down. Doesn't seem like you're piping anything. Yeah, it doesn't look like it, does it? <laughs> no. Oh god. Trailers. <laughs> Yeah, you can't you can't reverse like that. <laughs> Big red check to trap remix. So that means hypothetically you just fill up and then I sit here and wait and then you come along and then like just dump well, you can get on, like, dump a massive load. Oh yeah, that's a good point. Closing a lot of harvesting going on. Oh the lawn. <laughs> oh, dear. oh no. Oh god. Transport. Oh god. Okay. Can't keep a straight line. No. It's like Stardew Valley, but with machines. Yeah. I'm, I'm swimming. I mean, I'm totally coming to help. <laughs> you bastard. <laughs> uh, leg. No, 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 no. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> no. Oh, no. <laughs> no. <laughs> See you going spastic in the background. <laughs> I fucked this up so much. Oh no. <laughs> Fuck <laughs> the way you walk is hilarious. <laughs> oh my god. So I'm like do, 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 do. <laughs> The way you walk is so fucking funny. It's like so you know that, angrily. You know that um that fucking video of the guy who like slaps that kid at that party and then just like keeps slapping people yeah and he's like walking yeah. all macho that is exactly what you look like and it's like you, you know when you're drunk and you're pretending not to be sober i mean what when you're pretending to be sober when you're drunk that's true mac this is exactly what you can expect from a completely automated farm 
it's just shit just going real whack. But then it comes down to this, is that shit, do you really need to completely automate it? Or do you just like pay a bunch of weirdos on the internet who like farming to just, you know, command the robots remotely to farm all your crops? Yeah. And then fuck up your f fields royally like I'm doing right now. <laughs> just the, like, the I mean, whole if you're getting paid for it, it's a little different, but... The whole concept that, you know, doctors could perform surgeries in other countries using high five like, like, high-speed internet. <laughs> yeah. How's everybody okay. doing? How's quarantine been? Oh, Jesus. It is 9-11. It is awkward. We've got 9-11 subscribers. So here oh, we God, go. I just okay. fucking... Like... Oh, my God, you're going too fast to <laughs> hell. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> I was what on cruise. I was in, past, I like, was in cruise control. What the fuck? I'm watching you. Oh god! Why are we going around. so far? Oh my god! <laughs> what is happening? Big red, <laughs> big red, <laughs> right. Okay, so what do I what do I do? Big red trick to how, trap remote. How do I? That reminds me of um, a few years ago. I was like, Mom, I had this fucking strange dream about growing up on a farm. And she was like, That's because you did. And I was just like. <laughs> holy shit <laughs> what the fuck she was like yeah you literally spent years of your life living on a farm whoa what okay. the fuck how can you jump that high this isn't assassin's creed this is farming crouch jumping, crouch jumping. i don't know crouch jump are crouch you serious jump. did valve make <laughs> you this? <can> crouch <laughs> i love the hairiest skillies wearing a hat and sunglasses <laughs> you're damn right in a cave um, it's impossible to see with these sunglasses on but as i'm american i always wear sunglasses harris kelly how are you in how you, oh i'm in it too hey harris kelly let's go oh shit harris kelly you hello <laughs> i've started ascending <laughs> a very fuck it doesn't work <laughs> i can't just sit on the car when it goes <laughs> don't we have to pay off a loan no, it's not. It's not um, Animal Crossing. Um, yeah. <laughs> How dare you, bro? There is straight up some vehicles coming. Do they know? Like, oh yeah, they do. Like I give a f single fuck. <laughs> this, this person can't go because the trailer's in the way. Bro, just indicate around it. Oh, oh my god, what have you done? <laughs> Here is Kelly. You need to get the fuck out of your tractor and look at what you've done. Look at this. I didn't I didn't do jack shit. This thing was just falling, alright? <laughs> there's this there's this backup of, of cars. It's not like a forest all over again, eh? I'm trying to sort <laughs> shit out. Like, you guys are in the distance of doing some fucking I'm trying to I'm trying to figure out how I can kind of pipe things into this, alright? There are, there is a three car pile up. This is three I car can't I can't fucking attach the thing because they've driven right up into it. <laughs> Fucking just keep pushing the trailer. Congratulations, <laughs> congratulations! This is what you get. This is what you get. Oh, I think it's a real life. You, did you do it? There you go. I've got a, I've got a connection. <laughs> now I can't move. I can't move now. The car has <laughs> the car has fucking like jacked me up. <laughs> the car is my favorite. I'm just gonna go. I can't move. This. I actually can't move now. Oh I'm no! There we go. Slow. We're moving. We're moving. Okay, hang on. And I can't oh, move God, enough because of the cars in the way. Oh, Jesus Christ! Oh, yeah, I pushed Jesus in. Christ! <laughs> fucking, yeah, there, beef, the fucking beef comes to this fucking mess of a thing that's happening. Did you steal these cars? <laughs> <laughs> Jesus <laughs> fucking hell. There, we're fucking, we're, there. You can We've grab the trailer now. We've done it now. I've moved it. <laughs> Jesus. Uh, I was fucking watching you. Whoa, well, you fucking like jackknife the entire front end. <laughs> yeah, but you can still detach it because you just got to go over here. <laughs> Beef your fucking walk cycle, man. Okay. It's stiffer than Harry Skelly's. Why is that? I want out you. I want out you. I want out you. I want out you. Yeah, yeah. What? What? Like, you figured it out? Holy fuck, you with... fucking took it off. Holy I, fuck. I literally, I literally asked <laughs> if you could take the top holding off. Well, I was, I, fucking Beef told me there wasn't one. <laughs> well, I clearly didn't look at the, all the options, alright? <laughs> I literally watching this stuff. I'm gonna fucking jump in the trailer and be covered in the, in the goodness of the sunflower seed. They've seen Why is there a worker? Be a bit. Why is there just some random chick doing this? Who hired a worker? <laughs> I did. <laughs> what the fuck? Where did you hire some AI to help us? Now we got yeah, fucking. Okay. Now we're losing money on this, <laughs> dude. Oh, what well. the fuck? Okay, hang on. There's three of us. You fire that person and send them back to law school. 
Yeah, it's <laughs> look at all this back this backed up traffic is coming through. Hey, that wasn't us this time. Oh my god, because that means that the traffic just goes around in a circle, and because um, you guys oh yeah, because we blocked it off. It's fucking it's stuck yeah. like that now. <laughs> yeah, they are stuck like that. Making my way down to it. <laughs> Going fast. <laughs> Somebody needs to take this clip and put that song the fuck over it. Oh god. Oh, okay, I can't I can't hit people. He's just running over pedestrians at speed. I mean I wasn't I wasn't trying to. Um, also, what are you talking about? Fuels up, fuels up to like maximum. <laughs> well, <laughs> maximum. The fuel is like full fuel of maximum. Of Hang on, hop hop out, hop out. <laughs> So that's not E. No. <laughs> Whoa, is there actually a fucking vehicle shop here? Yeah. Yeah. That's this game is great. Why haven't we been playing this in the past? Because it's not been free. <laughs> <laughs> Driving along hitting road signs. That's what happens when I start reading chat. Like Twitch is popping off. It's all color coded, so my fucking lizard brain is like <laughs> lizard brain. <laughs> and that fucking colour's popping on the screen. Oh shit. Oh shit. Yeah. That must be prey, prey animal or insect. <laughs> Not even corporeal. Why have you spun around uh, again? What is happening here? Because he keeps hitting me with a trailer. <laughs> <laughs> that is 100% happening. Actually, I might come pick up some Harriet Skelly juice. I'll get my pipe out. <laughs> you know what it is. See, I'm so glad you said that. I wanted so I wanted Beef to say that the three times I was talking to him, and he never did. Bro, I'm filling up with sunflowers right now. Oh, I'll fill you up with my seed. My sunflower nah. seed. Oh, fuck, I'm so glad you said seed. Oh, God. <laughs> fucking do it. Do it sp fucking do it spin outs. Oh, spare scroll. My apologies. Must be a necromancer thing, I'm guessing. Could be wrong. If I'm wrong, that's okay. You know, I'm big enough to understand what I'm wrong. <laughs> Bro, when your pipe comes out, it actually looks fucking straight up. <laughs> It like shakes a little bit before it shoots the seed at me. Oh, it's all gone. This is why you have to be 21. <laughs> this is. Thrilling week. Mm -hmm. Oh, dear. You're totally not a dragon. There's no dragons here. What are mm. you talking about? No, there is. It's, it's dead on the ground. There no, is a dead zombie dragon. on the drink. It's a dead zombie drink. There was a dead zombie drink. It was a, it was a zombie dragon. It's a zombie dragon. There you go. It was. It's a, it's a, it's a, it's a, it's a, it's a dead undead zo um, zombie dragon. <laughs> they finally laid to zombie. rest. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway, um, last time. <laughs> on, uh, Previously on D and D. D and D. We were um, epically betrayed. Yep. Yeah. The team um had uh beginning off the team had come back um to town to uh, haroga they were staying with um jamie uh we got off a break first had a good time um then lana showed up um and basically said that uh she might know where rillin is because some weird shit's been happening up north um so the team set out with lana um found themselves at um the sort of graveyard um sort of graveyardy religiousy shriney sort of place um there was uh, a, a small um not really township just just a set of homes um for the caretakers um that had been ransacked and um was empty and then found themselves over to this here um stone circle stonehenge um and found Rillin, who seemed to have summoned um, a whole lot of undead. Um, they killed the undead. Lana got herself mega killed by Rillin. Um, Rillin then seemingly brought her back to life. Um, mm. Unsure. Not yeah. Not um, undead. Not, uh, not in an undead fashion. She seems like she's got her fa faculties at the moment. Uh, but he did bring her back to life. Um, and he did seem to use divine energy for that, um, which seemed to also wane his dark energy that he seemed to have. Um, but then, um, <clears throat> after taking out all the undead, uh, Rylan got a little bit scared, um, you know, messing around in his neighborhood, um, turned his life upside down. Yes, that's the one. Anyway, um, <clears throat> um, so he 
cover the place in darkness, um, and then summoned a zombie dragon that the team managed to take down. Um, and this is where we are, just having killed the zombie dragon. So, as far as Ailey's concerned, they think that this was Rillian's attempt to make someone else go through what he just went through. Okay. All, like dying and having his entire religion questioned, so of course he's going to do it to his friend. <laughs> Makes Make sense. Him feel the same. He seemed to like only come out of his dark, gloomy moment when he realized she was dead to bring her back and use a different kind of magic there. So it almost seemed like an internal struggle, though. Some of that are dastardly plan. Could be both. Mm. Definitely seem like a trap. Oh yeah. Does he hate us now? Mm, good well, question. Did kind of get him killed, and then qu he had to question his entire life and religion and everything. Came with us willingly. Yeah. And we... he got some hot chick, you know, brought him back to life. What's wrong with that? <laughs> <laughs> Bucky Buster he... got touched by Jamie, so like. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. What are you about? Uh, What's this problem? Oh dear. Hey, Bigot, you don't need to cover your foot. Oh, that's how that happened. Oh, I see. Amazing. Um, <clears throat> okay, well, I imagine that you guys are right, talking to each other, like, in-game. Um, yeah. So, as you're saying this, um... Hodswallop's gonna sniff around. Um... <laughs> Lana... Um, she's so she seems to have uh, that similar look on her face as to when Rillin was resurrected. Um, well, shit. That's why Ailey's like. And she says. I think she did this she says. <laughs> <laughs> I know what Rillin saw. Her. I know why. I think I know why. He's turned out like this. At least I, I think that's, I think that's what's going on here. Couldn't really couldn't be much worse. Well, let me, let me explain what I saw. Maybe. <laughs> so I, so it's not. So it doesn't seem like I uh, went crazy or anything. Um. So. One moment, I was facing down Rillin, and then the next moment, I was, my eyes flicked open, and I was submerged in, in lapping water. I was lapping up on my face. I looked out, and I saw, I saw a red sky and a black ocean stretching out in front of me all the way out and I was I was stone I wasn't myself it was like a statue forced to to look in that direction and I was just stuck in water just kept lapping at my face up, up my neck and she's breathing heavily and, and shaking. I saw her staring at the, the that I was forced to stare at uh, a black sun, a ring of fire. And it wasn't it wasn't just me. There was thousands, millions of of stone statues out in front of me, some deeper underwater than others. Is this? <laughs> Ailey, like, <laughs> who's next to them? Willie. <laughs> Ailey's next to them. Willie? <laughs> what is this? Um, well, roll a religion check. We'll see. Um, and she says, Yeah, you have no fucking idea what religion yeah, it has sounds to do with like, Less like a religion, more like a doomsday prophecy. Anyway, um, 
she says, saying, and then no. just before I, just before I came back, I heard a voice, and I think it said, <laughs> she says in terrible, terrible abyssal, um, oh, abyssal, yeah, that, uh, fucking, um, Thrykus understands, she, she's understand very bad, my... so infernal, you, infernal, that's the one, um, I would understand. I was like, would what? Well, you you would you would understand if they knew what they were saying. Um, ah, but they don't. Yeah, so they, she doesn't understand what she's saying. She just repeats the word that she she heard. Um, yeah, and in, in, in infernal um, that Thrykus understands as um, welcome. Uh. Um, she's you know she's trying her best to pronounce it. Um, and and then I woke up. If, uh, if I'd stayed there much longer, I don't, I don't know what, uh, what creature was waiting there for me, but if it was waiting there for Rillin, I could understand why he may have come back changed. There's, there's something very dark here in this continent that is pulled our souls away from where we're supposed to go. I don't know what kind uh, of creature has that power. Uh, you think it could have anything to do with what predated people coming to this place? There might be a reason there was all this metal and places actually made and there was nobody here. Could be. It could be. I know the elves have been here for a long time and they... They haven't spoken of anything. Well, I guess we haven't really made much contact with them. Uh, your friend, um, the ambassador, Jamie, right? She maybe she knows something about this. She's been resurrecting people yes. around here. She yeah. perhaps seems like something she has a know. nice long talk with her. Yeah. But um, yeah. Um, this is not I'm just gonna I'm just gonna sit here for a moment. <laughs> yeah. So so guys, uh I don't like we should be telling an awful lot of people the details of the fact that Rillin is the evil person that it reflects extraordinarily badly on us as a party member, and also extraordinarily badly on Jamie, who resurrected him. Also extremely bad upon the religious people in the chicken church. Yeah, they'll get mad. They'll get they mad. well, they they are already uh, not liked among the people. Yeah. Religion but in general also seems they, to have a bad may, vibe here. They also compensate for that with um. Well, you know, the whole pitchfork act towards yeah <laughs> the, uh, parties. I don't. I don't trust. I'm. Yep. Yeah. I understand. And I inherently do not trust a lot of religious people. Uh, it's, you know, mm. it's just to my whole face. I, I don't have my fan yeah. on. Or did I in that one? Or did you someone else have did. a fan on in that one? What? Just talking to nine. Uh. uh yeah. So. We're all pretty messed up. Well, and again, it's got one away. downloaded from Twitch, so that will have the worst sound. <clears throat> um, so do we want to try to go back to that little hamlet and have a rest? Yes, at least on? there are pretty chairs and beds and things to mm -hmm. lay on. Mm -hmm. And not a really gross smelling meat dragon. Mm -hmm. Yes. <laughs> Oh well, I'll have a look at it, but uh, and I'll have a look at the other ones. Not you don't want to. Sure. You don't want to uh, take a couple of these claws or a bone or something. Dude, this stuff reeks. I'm not. Nah. Mm. That, is it? Is I it, mean, Cod, genuine Codswell up. Uh, Codswell up certainly tried to uh, to get himself a femur or something, and oh, you had no. to wrench it out of his mouth. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh, God. <laughs> Um, Drop it. But he does go for a dragon bone, which is probably 
probably strong enough to um to handle him if you want to let him have one of those rancid is it no 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 whatever magic um imbued him um and the fact that he's a dragon as well magic in nature has protected a lot of him from the from the elements um it's mainly his his muscles and stuff um that have like petrified more than rotted okay. so what's the state of the skin uh it's is shredded there there's there's barely a scale you can't okay. even tell yeah. what dragon it was before it was zombified what kind of Monster. color it was or anything Did it happen to have right, any horns? Never any what? Any horns? Mm, no. Mm. Just checking. Any good enough for dog food, huh? <laughs> well, the bones are anyway. The meat yeah, certainly not. Not the rest. Sweet. So you're all making it back to the we'll go back to the old uh, shacks. Um and um it's probably about midday. So um do you wanna, what do you wanna do? Yes. <laughs> you just kinda sleep? Well, if that's what everyone else is doing, yes. Nap times! <laughs> okay. Um, you want to do anything before you sleep? Anyone who's doing crafty things or anything yeah. like that? Yeah. I'll, uh... Wait, how many did I fly a I have three... I have three casings for um, bad news bullets, so I'll just try and fill those up. Sweet. This place is enough beds that Cold Swallow gets one. Nice. It's big enough for them. Nice. Oh. Yeah, you fill them in no time. Awesome. <laughs> you have any um shells you want to fill for the other type as well or uh i think i do have some casings left from that yeah i have six of those well then you fill all you fill all those there. as well <laughs> right yeah. i don't remember how many fucking bolts i have there <laughs> right. 30 total now not 230 30. right here Not everyone gets their own little thing, except for Joe. <laughs> <laughs> there's there's a bed for Joe if he wants one, but it just... yeah, I have to sleep next to 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 Ailey though. But <laughs> he doesn't need a bed. He's Wait, sort of just know. he's sort of just standing out there. Cool. Um. So you guys sort of settle in. Um for the uh for the for the day <laughs> essentially um yep. you know you take whatever <sighs> uncooked foods or anything you, know, you find around um that's left behind in the um in the place make yourself some lunch make yourself some dinner just chill out for a little bit um you know varus puts some bullets back in um in slots uh lana is just just coming to terms with everything essentially um she's just had quite an experience so she goes off into this room and just sort of stays there um until until uh food is brought to her um that joe happily takes to her um and yeah she seems like she's she's processing you know she's not um she's not overly happy with what she's what's going on but um mm -mm. she's just certainly coped a lot better than Rillan did um is she still actually functioning <laughs> Um, but then, um, go to sleep, um, Joe sort of 
assumes it's his role to just watch out for the night. Um, for the day. For the day. For the day and for the night. If you know, you, you spend the whole spend the rest of the, unless you want to get up at night. It's up to you guys. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> um, I assumed that you would, you know, just chill out until night time and then sleep through the night, um, and make it to the next day. Yeah. Sun rises. Um, you know, sun comes through the, the broken, not broken, the empty windows and to wake you all up, gather yourselves together, make your way outside into, into the thing, notice that, uh, that Joe is just sort of standing there, <laughs> just looking at the, at the, the embers of the fire that you lit, lit up last night. Sweet Joe. Mm -hmm. What's the plan? Well, I mean, we investigated what we could while we were here. We found out the cause. Hmm. We have now lost where the cause has gone. Yes. It seems kind of like a. I mean, unless. I mean, this is forest land, yeah? Yeah. Well, he ran off into forest land. He least. did. Yeah. Is there any possibility of tracking him? Um, he's a paladin running through in heavy plate armor. He is. Is this, is this how you track? It would be. Maybe, yes. maybe get the uh, the the maybe ranger maybe. to do that. Has mm. forest yeah. advantage. Yes. Yeah. And is also actually dedicated to tracking things. I, mean, yeah. I have water <laughs> my survival. <laughs> Yeah, you I mean, you got a little. <laughs> if that's if that's the way you want to, that's what you want to do. You want to try and more? track him down. I'll try and track I him mean, down. We we Plus, investigated we kind the of one let place. Him sleep. I mean, we kind of let him go for like yeah, a Yeah, that's been sleep yeah. You went stuff. you went for a whole like half a day and, and a night. Uh, yeah. Oh, we were pretty messed up. You were. We can either do that or we can head back to town. We so you do, have... you do know that um, that even though you you know that there was an attack up north, um, that was oh I thought there was that was related to um something else. It was related to a mining town further north. Yeah. Um, this is the the one that that Lana was talking about. Um that was separate that that has sort of had been overarched by the fact that <laughs> that the mining town was attacked this was some people oh just out of town who were manning the cemetery run it ran back in and alerted the the church I that they were undead probably head to the mining town then i guess it's unlikely that we would find them i i forgot about the actual amount of time that had passed yeah so you might be able to track him down, but you know, I mean, it involves several several checks. Like um, eighteen <laughs> eighteen hours has essentially passed since then. Yeah, so mm. you'll see. You, 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 yeah. <laughs> Definitely a bit of a stab stab at the duck. Oh. Yeah, mining town's probably our best bit. Cool. Sweet. Oh. On the road again. I can't wait to get on the again. <laughs> on the road again. <laughs> I just cannot wait. We'll it's get on bad. the road again. Mm. Feel very well rested after not having to hear people snore. Mm. Mm. You slept in your own bed. Luxury. <laughs> So, um, so you guys had last yesterday had um, left Haroga um, yeah, just after sun up, essentially after doing a little bit of shopping. Um, so you only it's only a couple of hours, not even a couple of hours, really, just a you know, like an hour's walk out of out of Haroga, um, up where 
just past the river. Um, so, uh, the mining town, mining town is probably about half a day away. No. Yeah. Yeah. So you, you, you trudge through, um, make your way up to, um, this river here. Um, that seems to, um, essentially be the border between, um, the grasslands and the, um, the snowy sort of, um, sort of icy shelfy sort of, it's just, it's just white essentially from yeah. that point on. Um, you know, there's, there's, there's little blemishes in the, in the snow with like rocks and, and like some, tr some plant life has managed to make its way through, but it is mainly just a white expanse, um, out from there. <coughs> And there's a nice little bridge along the road um, that um, is manned by some guards um, as you approach. One of them um, calls out to you. Who goes there? Little one, you know my speech. <laughs> <laughs> he, he, he has been uncharacteristically quiet as well, too. Yeah. yeah. Socializing. Uh, we are here what to... What they look like? Uh, they look like yeah. humans in armor. We are here to uh, deal with... Uh, there has been some issue with the mining town. We come from Haroga. Oh. Um... We were told of attacks Aaron. up north. Yeah, there, there has been. You're an, an interesting band of mercenaries. Um, yeah, yes, we get that a lot. Okay. Um, well, it's your funeral. Yeah. Off you go. <laughs> we found out recently that that is not really a problem for some people. Oh. Mm. Okay. So what is, what is being... What is the problem? What well, kind of the situation that you could tell us? Well, all I've heard from uh, there's people coming back through and running terrified, you know, ramblings of, of scared, scared people. Um, it sounds like a bunch of metal men came out of the ground and just started attacking people. Um, yeah. And apparently there was lightning. Like in the in a completely clear day, just lightning and fire and burning and explosions. It sounds like magic to me. Yeah, you'd know better than me, man. Hmm. Uh, these metal men, description wise, did they seem anything like our companion here? I point backwards at Joe. Yeah, he like leans over to see him, sort of, and Joe is sort of hesitantly pulls up his cloak a little bit to not like scare him too much mm. no he's a little bit too too shiny i think nice um, yeah the ones that were described to me were like basically black mm. like rusted or mm. they come up from the mine not sure mm. all i know is then yeah they were metal yeah Everyone, the, those who could fight, tried fighting back and could do barely jack shit against any of them. This is usually the case. Um, where were the uh, largest concentrations of sightings? Uh, in the city proper. Um, there's a, there's sort of a mine in the center of the town. Uh, they sort of built around. Uh, they've they got walls up around it. Um, I don't know why that is, but they did. Um, so they, they sort of managed to keep a lot of the the fighting contained in there, as far as I'm aware. Um, but then, then something happened, and just all of them started to flee. Um, yeah, so we've had refugees coming through here. Well, a few days ago we had a, just a bulk of them come through, and now we're just getting a couple of stragglers. Most of them burned. Um some of the missing limbs uh yeah 
some a lot of them missing family members too. Some of them certainly didn't make it. Mm. Okay. Thank you very much. You're welcome. I hope you, uh, well, I wish you good fortune. <laughs> and to you too. Sweet. Trudge your way through the snow. Um, the path itself um, is um, it's st still <laughs> snowy, but it's like less. It's 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 covered in and like crunched in like darkened snow. Um, it's yeah, definitely it's, like it's not too deep. Then. No, it's 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 got its yeah. It, the snow around you, um, where it, where it's like some where it's piled up. Um, it off definitely, path, if it definitely, it? yeah, off the path, it would definitely come up to your head height. Um, mm -hmm. But it, you know, it's it's definitely patchy in places. Um, yeah. It seems like it's just, just like a layer of it. Um, and as you get further and further, and you, um, you notice that some of the the path is actually just ice. It's not, um, and it's ice that's got snow on it, as opposed mm -hmm. to to dirt lands. So it's like some of this area is it's not actually land it's it's, it's an ice like sheet permafrost. that's permafrost that's, that's come up mm. um that sort of flattened itself out in places <clears throat> um, and you make your way through that get a bit cold um you know it's it's definitely getting very uh chilly up there um but not enough to um to cause an exhaustion or anything like that just mm. it's just pretty chilly um you trudge through the snow for a few hours um don't really see anything out of the uh out of the ordinary until you um start to approach the mining town known as coal rock uh, and let me pop you on maybe Marcus, Amy, Carlin's wallet, Ferris. I now have Whitley. the Fraggle Rock theme song in my head, but going like Carl Rock. <laughs> of course. Carl Rock. Carl. 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 Um. <clears throat> yeah. So you make it to um to the outskirts of Carl Rock. Um. Mm. You can see, you can see it as you as you're approaching. Um, very clearly, uh, smoke billowing out um, of different area, different parts of it. Um, there's definitely some some fires burning. Um, mm, definitely not half fires, I'm assuming. No, just just big, mm. big smoke billowing out. Um, and yeah, as you approach, um, you're probably coming in from here. What we're doing. Um, <clears throat> yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah. As you as you get closer and closer, you can see that you know, it's a it's a shanty, essentially a shanty town, um, mostly from from this perspective anyway. Um, you know, some some rickety wooden buildings and stuff. Um, it's it's very much just lodgings four people to stay in while they're doing the mining and then you know they otherwise they're it's mainly a, an abandoned place um, but as you get further as you'd get further in as you can see further in um more buildings seem more stable than than the ones in the outskirts so uh, you know there's probably some form of of enterprise going on here um but you can see over the top of um some of them there is some walls that come up a little bit higher in the center of town um that you were you were told about that apparently block off the the mine area unsure mm. as to why probably related to uh to the war they had about this material they're mining but yeah, that's just a, that's just guesswork <laughs> <laughs> so what's the plan Probably just a cautious approach, I'd say. See? 
Uh, start walking your way in. Make it to the first crossroad. Um, this building, son. <coughs> buildings you um you pass by there they're absolutely deserted. Um, there's not really. Even looking in through the, the the doors that are open and the windows that that you can see through, there's there's nobody um, inside. Um, everything's been thrown around about the place. Um, you can hear the the um, ambient crackle and burning of of fires off in the distance, uh, but otherwise seems pretty um pretty still in this town at the moment. Deathly still. You could say that. Dun, dun, dun. So, do you want to make a beeline for the mine, or you want to search some houses, or? Search for clues. Search for clues. I don't know what find clues, but that's an, an investigation of the general place. Yeah, okay. let's check, probably check out a couple of houses. Oh Jesus! Oh well, Jesus Christ! You you just running in, okay? I don't know where is everyone else uh, over here. So everyone's you can, uh, you can see so, us. Yeah. So everyone is down here at this this crossroad here. Where 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 Joe is is where you guys are essentially. <coughs> um. There. Yeah. So, just want to do a general investigation. <laughs> okay. Yeah, okay. Yeah. I'd check out the An investigation the for which here. house to. Into. Okay. Um, so yeah, so you know, as you're walking past, you walk, you look in each window, look in every door that's open, um, making your way through. Um, you don't really see anything with anything of value in any of them. Um, you know, it, most of them are simple lodgings. Uh, looking through the window, you can see a bed and a um, and a chest of drawers and, and maybe some kitchenette equipment, um, but nothing, um, nothing really else. Um, you know, maybe you see some, some mining tools in a couple of them, um, but it is essentially just, just simple lodgings for mining folk. But, um, yeah, at this, uh, this part of the, um, the, of the town does not seem to be, uh, it does not seem to have been attacked at all. Um, it's mm -hmm. thoroughly intact. There's no fires close by. You can see, um, you can see off in the distance that they are very much centered around the, the mining area. Okay. I'll cautiously head further up then, going to the next. Okay. Next. Up on the next crossroad. Um, you do see, um, a fire burning. Um, in one of the houses um, up this way um, mm. so like you see the house uh, at the crossroad and then right behind it there's definitely a house on fire um, you know the snow and the, and the ice is sort of keeping it uh, keeping it low um, mm. so it, it, smoke is pouring out of it um, definitely one of the, the bigger ones that you've, you've seen come, coming in mm. And these are these houses the the shanty sort of shack type things. Yeah, so now yeah. you've now you've got in these ones are a little bit more constructed. Um you know, there's some stonework, some some wood stuff. Um you're still peering through windows. Um you know, it, it's still very simple simple lodgings. It's not it's not nearly as bad as just a bed. Um but it's mm -hmm. you know, it's, it's these ones have kitchens, these ones um seem to have other rooms in them that they could be bathrooms or, or lounges or more, more, more amenities but still no no furnishings or anything like that no like no paintings no um no jewelry no no like fancy vases or anything like that just just places where the working man has lived um is there anything can, can we hear anything coming from the burning building aside from you know the crackle of flame obviously um roll of perception Why are most of us to work, do it? Or... It depends on who wants to listen out for stuff. Do not I hear much? But no, you're still just just hearing the crackling of of burning wood 
and ice melting and sizzling inside of it. Mm. We're just trying to listen out and see if there was anybody still stuck in there or anything. No, no, no screams or yelps or anything. Same, same for you, Thrakus. Did it say they were all dead? Yeah. Or running, or had, or had run away. Yeah. yeah. Um, and the flame itself, there's there's nothing peculiar about it. it no. It just looks like regular old flame. Yeah, the flames that you can see that look up, um, just red and regular fire. Nothing, nothing magical about it, it seems. Yeah, that, that was my, my thought. Mm. Thought pattern with that question. Yeah. Um, yeah. Aside honest, from the smoke, um, it's still a... a Fantastically clear day. Fantastic spring clear day. Womp. Onward and upward, I assume. Cool. So cautiously moving forward. And come up to the entrance of the um of the uh mining area. Um passing several burning buildings on your way through mm. you don't spot any um any movement um any any of the clockwork and that you're familiar with um, streets are entirely empty um you know the the roads um as you had gotten closer the roads uh you know had been recently shoveled um so that the snow cover on them is, is um, pretty thin um, if, if at all, um, mm. as you got closer and closer, um, it turned into more of a paved sort of, um, stony road. Um, um, yeah, um, but it's completely clear. There's, there's no, um, you know, there's, there's some carts in the street, um, but there's no people or anything around. Um, it's entirely, entirely still. Hmm. It's a bit unnerving. Hmm. Well, uh, should we... Should we head in? Yes? Yes. Sweet. So you much your way through the gate. Into the um, into the mining area. Um, well, into the in between the, the gates, coming up against where the um, where the mine. Um, so it's a it's a stone building. Um, it seems um, it's quite a bit larger than a lot of the buildings around you. Um, but there's like a big wide opening at the front, um, mm. where it seems to go directly down into a big big tunnel. Okay, um, so, oh, so there's a building kind of on top of that? Yeah, and there's a building on top right. of that. That's that's like, you know, this seems to be like, um, you know, there's tools and stuff laying across this, laying against the side of it and on the front of it, mining gear picks and, and all that sort of stuff and some um, some contraptions that, um, that are, you know, you, you're familiar familiar enough with to know that they're digger, digging tools, um, but there seems to be like a, um, not so much a, kind of like a castle-esque sort of thing going on here where it's it's entirely stone uh, like another stone level up and to the side there's a um there's a an, another opening there's a, a two big wooden doors that have been fucking destroyed in mm. two um and you can see from from um from the entrance that there there are like some tables and stuff in there mm. so it's probably like you know, canteen area for the for the workers um, so were the were the doors burst inward or outward? Burst inward, inward. Okay. <clears throat> um, but as you, um, you know, as you finally everyone has made their way through, can I get you to roll um, perception checks? Absolutely. Okay. Where is her perception? Okay. 
everyone else. Yeah. I've rolled for... Oh. Oh dear. Rolled yeah, for Pyro. As I was paying. That one is uh, still with you. Still running, rolling at an advantage there, uh, Vivian Danny. <laughs> yep. There's a 13. 22, 7, 5. 13, yeah, so. It's fine. <laughs> um, Lana. Perception. Joe. Perception. Perception. Okay, so. <clears throat> Joe. No. Is it Joe or is it Lana? No, it was Joe. So, Lana, Varys. Just Lana and Varys. Um, mm -hmm. You notice that um, there's like a a sort of rumble. You can feel from your feet that the ground is it's got like a low hum coming through it um it seems to be getting a bit getting closer it seems so it's it's directionally sort of coming from further down the mine shaft it feels like right it's coming it from right below you okay hmm I think I'd probably point I'd probably point that out to everyone so to just be on the alert for it. So that okay. usually spells trouble, especially seeing as we were told that these things just kind of burst out of the ground. Yeah. Uh, mm. Cool. Gun at the ready. Walking further down. So you're gonna go into the mine or you're gonna go to the um Oh the building? The building. Maybe we check that out first. What does everyone think? Yeah, my first yep, this is good. See? Um, yeah. That is wow, that's an old map. That's not gonna work either. Fuck. What do I do with that? Oh well. Um <clears throat> okay, you enter the, um, you enter the, the through the doors, mm. um, and yeah, there's definitely, um, tables, um, you know, some of them thrown across, there's you know, food and, and drink, um, that's got a little bit rancid, um, it's been thrown across the ground, um, it's a, it's a pretty, pretty wide room, um, that seems to take up most of the, um, the bottom level. Um, is a little is it like a stairwell? I'm um, off to the side, and that goes up onto the second level. But the first level, so it's mainly just just a whole lot of tables and chairs, like a it's like laid out like a tavern, um, essentially. Um, okay. So it's probably like the canteen area for for a lot of the um, a lot of the workers, um, and you can see a couple of the dead workers um, just laying face down in their own blood off to the side. Um, They've sort of been lined up, sort of. So some of them have been leaned up against the wall, um, you know, as much as one can lean a dead body. Um, and others are just, you know, sort of pushed up against it. Um, you know, it's like five, five or six of them, just laying there dead in their own blood. Uh, what sort of what sort of wounds do they have? Uh, a big, heavy bladed ones um you know nice big straight edges um a lot of them's just like heads entirely gone similar to work we've seen from the clockworks before yes okay. i'd probably point that out to the rest of the party if they hadn't already seen it sweet i'll give you 
chemistry. Machine precision. <laughs> um, there should be, there should be a fourteen forty p. Um, I just haven't. I've so I've got the I've got the screen. I've got, I've got, the web page at a smaller resolution, so I can have some other stuff down the side of my screen, um, and it fits it fits nicely in, in the thing. So. Um. Yeah. Anyway. Um. Yeah. So you get that stuff pointed out to you. Um, you trudge around. Um, there doesn't seem to be much, much else here. Um, and these dead bodies. Mm. Yeah, they've got. You know, there's off to the side. Um, there's like a, a a big rack of of tools. Um, that are just like pickaxes and hammers and and um, all that sort of anything that's made for for breaking rock and, and dirt shovels all that stuff mm. all just sort of regular mining type equipment yeah nothing yeah. standing out nothing standing out okay. to you at the moment okay. so we're going upstairs Trudge up the stairs. Similar scenario up here. Um, there's a couple of um, it's it's a little bit more constructed, so there's a couple of rooms and stuff. Um, you go through them all, no problems. Um, yeah, some of them contain dead bodies, um, stabbed nicely, cleanly, dead. Um, seems to be like form an office. Um, so there's a bunch of papers and, and desks and stuff in a bunch of them. Uh, but then there's like a, um, a sort of a, a, a larger, opener, more open room that, um, that has some some furnishings to it, some lounging stuff, you know, some couches and, and a bigger um, a bigger desk. Um, this is like a, a, a there's a framed a single framed picture on the wall of a of a dwarf in a um, at a nice nice uh garb um and then you see the same dwarf um dead on the ground next to it unfortunately Oof. seemed to be um owner, op owner or operator or mayor or head foreman something like that but he's dead somebody fairly high ranking with them yeah mm. uh same sort of death marks as everybody else yeah Nice big straight edge, right there. Um, there, there probably wasn't any way of closing the mine, was there? Um, there didn't seem to be like gates or anything. Um, yeah, sorry, that was more what I was yeah, asking. There wasn't, there wasn't an, an inbuilt way of doing that, but um. You know, you you probably imagine that there's there's certainly some way that you can close it. <laughs> so, what's the plan? Come back down. Yes. No. Maybe. Sure. <laughs> Let's do this. See, as you make your way, way down, um, as you have been pointed out to you, there was the, the rumbling under the uh, under the ground that you've you were aware of. As you uh, get onto the ground floor, you realize that that rumbling has um, it's gotten quite quite a bit. You could swear that it's it's sort of trembling the ground now. That loose rocks and stuff seem to be moving. Mm. Can they continue outside? You know, was everyone else want to do? I, d I don't want to be stuck in a mine to die. <laughs> fair. Entirely fair, yeah. Okay. Last time I was in a cave, it didn't go well for me. Hmm, that's true. <laughs> Sweet. So you guys make your way out the doors into the courtyard area. Um, when the rumbling comes to a full crescendo. And work, work. two <laughs> human-sized figures 
burst out of the ground. Um, just just a little bit off from you. And I'll put you on it, maybe, shouldn't we? I'm back. What happened? Uh, you looked in a place... Um, that's the wrong one. I can't tell what the icon is supposed to be a picture of. Um, yeah, so you went to the mine, you looked at the thing above it, um, the, the building that's on top of it, essentially. Um, you know, went through, found a whole bunch of dead bodies, um, found the head foreman, um, dead in his office. Seemingly his office. Right. We got Alana. We got a Joe. And uh, we got a Codswap. We got an Ailey. We got a Thoracus. And a Varus. And we got a Willy. Gee. Yep. Every time. <laughs> all right. I'm just here for the comic relief, all right? Yep. So, two things burst out of the ground. Um, yeah, quite far from you. Um, just just off in the center where the um, where the where the mine. Where, just, just 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 there's a there's a large open area between the mine and the walls, and they have popped up basically in between you and the exit of the of the walls. Um, a roll initiative. So yeah, roll roll initiative. Oh. Um, bearing in mind that the um, hold on, you probably want to hold that hold on for a second while I bring up the turn yeah. timer. Right, we can always re-roll. Okay. This. Wet. Try again. All right, please uh, try again. Only we had owls on there. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah. Okay. What were we saying? Please. Yeah, it's like a bit. I was bringing up the turn order machine, so please now. Oh, right. Please now do. I did we not both roll get us seven. Yeah, so it works out <laughs> for you. Two more points. Okay, here it works. Joe, this time, not forgotten. Lana. Missing... Well, because he's gonna have to get out of this with us too. Yeah, we're missing Averis. What's happened to him? He died. <laughs> Ailey? What? What's happened to Averis? I don't know. They were at the computer angry that I interrupted them before when I came out from being sick. It was like, what happened? And they're like, I'm talking. They go, okay. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I. Last I. Saw I... Yes, I'm here. Um, I had clicked on my character, but apparently not. So I had rolled for you. Okay, thank you. So, you're good now. Um, cool. Well, uh, let's see everybody. Uh, bearing in mind that there is still rumbling under the ground. Um, not nearly as badly as it was before, but still rumbling. Um, and it is now... It is Lana's turn. She rolled really high. So, she is going to... Fifteen feet. Um, let's Okay, she is going to cast Spirit Guardians, um, and around her spreads a bright light, um, and those of you. Someone's really scratchy. I think it's voodoo. Me? Um, My audio? Yeah, just a bit. Um, 
So, actually, if you were in the range. Um, you see... You could swear that you see um, little angelic figures in the light. As you, um, as they sparkle around you. Um, you imagine that, um, that enemies in this area will probably get themselves a bit hurt. Um, and then she moves her uh, movement. Cool. Uh, Varys. I'm going to move up to here. And I'm going to take like two shots now. Damn. Ha 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 ha. On that one. On the left. On the left. It's a nada for the first one, I'm guessing. No. Ah, I'm the same again. <sighs> Ouch. Yep. Yeah, that's good. Cool. Hit air. Oh, it's gone. Yeah, nothing. That's the two. Alright. Sure. It's kind of a move. It is 30. Um, and give this one a scorching me. Um, and we did that three rays. Cool. I think they all hit. They all did. Nice. Uh, it's five. Minus twelve. Minus. Six. Sweet. There's Justin. See ya. Let's off two burning rays slamming into the side of this one. It is now Ailey's turn. Um, how far away is distance? 65 feet. That was in... Where's the, the info thing for that to know? What are you trying to do? 60 foot? It has to... How does it have to be within? What are you? What are you? Oh no, a range is eighty. All right, that's fine. Or what? is it eighty is bad? What? What are you? What are you? What are you talking about? The distance before I have to start rolling at disadvantage. Yeah. So what is it? Short bow. I can't remember. What, I, yeah, what's the? What's the, what is it? What is it? What is the first number? First number 80. is eighty. Yes. So you go up until eighty. So. Okay. Nice. Oh yeah, I I got him. Then. Crit. I so, appreciate it, but I correct. This one? <laughs> oh, but, wait, why did it include sneak? I didn't have sneak turned on. Because you got a crit, right? Oh, yeah. You still get... Do you still get that for crit? I guess Does that so. how that works? Hold I on. Really so. Let me look. I'm not sure. Let me look. Let me look at your thing. Sneaky, 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 sneak. You don't need advantage on the attack another enemy so if you had an advantage on the attack you would get sneak attack damage uh, um if you don't have a damage no so you don't get sneak attack but it's fine if it why did it i don't know do it, it did I... it. hey i just want to try rolling it without uh, let's ignore this one it seems to be auto adding sneak i've turned have it you got it on. okay it's now it's your... okay that's weird also, you should just... have three d6. Those are just two. Yeah. So turn it back on. Try again. I just want to see. We'll go, we're still going uh, with your first turn one. It on. Yeah. There we go. That's how it should be. But anyway, anyway. you didn't get yeah, sneak attack, so eight. just take the nine. Yeah, nine. Nine damage. Um, and. 
yeah, I'll just stay there. There's no point moving closer. Okay. But now, as long as no one stays in the water. Well, yeah. Well, well, I... What type of a... Did I mute myself? Am I hmm. less scratchy or still scratchy? You're good. Yes. Yeah. Um, Alright, so I guess I'll run up. Oh, Jesus. That's not the message. Run to! I guess I'll run up to the bar. So I can run up to the now. Because I do have this fancy new spell, but it... you don't have any ranged attacks, do you? I do. Uh, let, them, let them waste their time do? coming to us. No, no, because I could do something real cool <laughs> if you're not in the firing range. All right. Um, well, I, he uh, doesn't know that currently. <laughs> no, I know shit. But I, I'll yep. go there and then hold my action. So okay. If they come up to me, in my, you know, in the direction they come up to me, I will smack them in the face. See, good, because this one's coming up to you. I'll smack him in the face. Okay. Oh, your attack. Uh, recklessly attack. Uh, I get to attack twice oh. now because reasons. Mm -hmm. You're not raging now, are you? I'm not raging now. Okay. So does 18 hit? Yep. And 14 hits too. That's oh, sweet. So 24 damage. Clang, clang, middle. Strikes middle. Thrakus. Wow. Alright. Range of 150 feet. Yeah, you can absolutely hit this. <laughs> yeah, 100%. Um, so I'm going to cast Spike Growth. Okay. Does that cast properly? Yeah. Well, I see it. Yep. Where, where do you want it? Um... I want it to not hit Willy, but I want it to hit that thing. So from this point, there's a 20 foot radius. Okay. Killer radius. Wish I could. Wish there was a thing for just like putting down a thing. Anyway, uh, 20 foot radius. So you want it to hit that but not him so oh, I think it from so like I'm pretty sure it was there from there yeah so that one. let's put I'm a circle down all right that's not you know um it's from here yeah, but it's also 20 foot this way. Oh, yeah, right, from that space. You're right. Uh, I was doing it from him. Not doing, not doing it the right fuck. Mm -hmm. Did you realize I had this mm -hmm. hidden? I can see it anyway. There you go. So, in that... In that radius and you see burst from the ground a bunch of um jagged spikes and and twists and thorns and vines whip up out of the ground and cover the uh, cover the ground and um and uh and a lot of shit um and it's become a difficult oh. terrain um, and creature moving in and out of the area, in or within the area, into or within the area, will take 2d4 piercing damage for every 5 feet. Nice. Um, so I bonus action. I want um, and hold on, any creature that can't see the area at the time, the spell is going Oh, no, everyone can see it. They know it's right. hazardous, but they're in it. Yeah. Cool. So that's um, your so for bonus action, I wanted to slay as prey this guy. And because I get two attacks. Yeah, I guess it was a spell attack, so sure. Are you going to say that I couldn't attack after that? I mean, 
So some some Generally how I would take it, yeah. Yeah, some spells I'll take up the entire turn. Take up an entire action. Um but Yeah, but I get two because of the You yeah. get an extra attack. Yeah. So you can take two attacks. The, the way it's worded is weird. Yeah. That is two attacks. Yeah, it's, I'm saying that it is a spell attack, so I will give you another attack. But if you were if you like did a full on spell that required like full on verbal required like some serious stuff, then it might not necessarily allow you to attack as well. So. Yeah, taking the attack action any, is though. is different to taking a spell action. Yeah. It's worded really stupidly. It is. But it's fine, you can take your attack. Do I hit this guy? Yes. Cool. <laughs> um, and he's slayer parade, so it's... So, here D6. Six. There we go. A. Dane damage. Cool. Um, one, two, three. Two, three, four for every five, so three. So that's... 64. Can you roll 64 damage, please? Okay. Yep. Cool thing. Oh, uh, I don't think it's up to 5 now. Fuck. Mm -hmm. You have to uh, slash roll. Alright, let's do that. Okay. 14. 14 damage to. Two net ones in that bam. Yep. 14 damage to that bad boy. Um, and he is going to. Um. Oh fuck! This guy didn't attack either. So, yeah. uh, <laughs> <laughs> right, I'm I'm fucking I let Willie go and didn't didn't get his attack off. Um, okay, so the first one is gonna attack Willie, obviously, and he makes his um, bladed attack and his slam attack. Um, nine on the blade, they'll miss. Fifteen? Does fifteen hit Willie? It does. Okay, so 13 bludgeoning damage. Ow. Um, and then the second one's going to go. His blades and his slam. Um, 25 to hit, yes. No. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 18 slashing damage and 20 to hit, 11 slashing damage. So that is a total of 13, 18, and 11. And so what's the total? <laughs> yeah. Let's bring up the old... The old calculator. Uh, 13. Yes. 18 plus 11. 42. Ow. Yeah. Uh, the math. Sweet. Cool. So we fix. So, on a to read that spell. Okay. Lana's gonna move up here. Can she move there? Yes. No problems. Cool. And they both have to make wisdom saving throws. First one for the left. Second one for the right. Eh? Howdy, chill, buddy. How are you doing? Okay, that didn't make sense. Let me try that again. Okay. First one. Will not make the save. Uh, 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 uh. Three, two, eight. Cool. Sorry. Doing full damage to that one and half damage to that one. Sweet, and then she is going to, seeing that you've been uh, been a bit cut there, um, she's going to cast Cure Wounds on you. On me? On ya. 
Uh, to heal you for eight. Delicious. There's those nice fresh cuts. Close. She places her nice warm hand against your willy. <laughs> uh, Varys, you're up. <laughs> what? Varys, what? you're up. <laughs> Varys, oh, your God. turn. <laughs> Lord, I don't think I can follow that. <laughs> I'm going to go over here and uh, take some shots on this guy. Sweet. Eighteen to hit. Eighteen, yep, that'll do it. Nice. Sixteen. Oh yeah, that'll hit. Basically the same damage. Yep. <laughs> same damage. It slams huge bolts right into the side of of that one. Knocking it sort of Sort of off of its feet, it uh, you know, rights itself, but certainly did did a chunk of damage to it. Nice. Right. Sure, my boy. My boy. Um, it's gonna move his way over here, and then throw another scorching ray in. And this one this time. Fire and three bolts fire. Fucking missing every single one of them. God damn it, Joe. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, Ailey. Alright, well, I can't fucking see it in from there, so I'm gonna have to like. Eh. Yep. And I can turn on sneak because now they're standing next to someone. Ha <laughs> ha. Yes. Twenty-two. Did I hit? Yes. <laughs> um, plus eight. So that one, 50. obviously, which yep. is within range. Cool. That's it. Yeah. Willie. Yep. Hmm. I think it might be a good time to rage. Mm. <laughs> um, and I will smack for the one that I was smacking before. Sweet. Uh, uh, no, if a flesh dragon isn't a dragon, they can get you out of stop up. Thankfully not. Uh, so 13 damage, for, uh, 14 mm. hits, and then uh, 8 damage if a 23 hits. <laughs> Okay, so thirteen and eight. Yeah, I'll be back in two seconds. I'm just gonna grab some water. Okay, um, you're about to get attacked, so. Oh, okay, I'll wait. I'll wait. <laughs> Hold. Uh, if um. For us, it was basically a zombie dragon, with extra flesh on it. Mmm, it was. <laughs> um, <laughs> eleven half to five. And 14 half to 7. How do you know they hit? Because <laughs> it's a 24 and a 23. <laughs> oh. uh, so, what was it, sorry? Uh, uh, 5 and six. 7. 5 and 7. So, 12. I mean, if you want to try and eat it, go ahead. It could be a uh, BRB. Sweet. Rikus. Yo. Um, so, do I have enough of a clear shot there? Not really. Yeah, I'm afraid not. Scooch. Scooch to the side. Uh, Clear a shot. Wish I had piercing shot. Hmm. Alright, so I'm going on the same guy who has Slayer's Parade. Sweet. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that doesn't hit. My second one. Yep. And when it's. A, if not. A D6 of damage. So nine damage. Sweet. Um, so the one that you shot at. Mm -hmm. uh, 
it sort of leans back and opens its jaw and gives out a, a loud crackle in the um, in that uh, dial tone sort of Uh-oh. um the Joe, broken <laughs> yeah Joe takes a step back um <laughs> what did you say about my mother she wasn't a snowblower <laughs> oh no <laughs> mother was a snowblower <laughs> Hey, laser lips. Um, oh, and uh, it's still actually his turn. Um, so he's going to have to need to make him make a wisdom saving throw, I think. Again. Yeah, every time they're in the wisdom saving throws. So that'll be both of them. Um, well, that one makes it, so that's fine. Mm-hmm. That one fails. Three D eight. This, uh, this one takes seven. This one takes fifteen. Um, and he's going to slam blades and slam against Willie again. Oh no! Uh, an eleven won't hit. Thir- Thirteen. Thirteen won't hit, right? Negative. So Negatory. Both of those miss. Now it is my turn. Willie alone. <laughs> Um, um, she's going to give you another cute ones. You're for nine. Thanks. Um, you have now noticed that uh, the rumbling has gotten a bit closer, a lot closer again, yeah, um, yeah. similar to before at the uh, they popped out of the ground. Mm. Paris, you're up. Um, okay, let me go over here for a Clear a, clear a shot on them. Sweet. And just same again, going for the the one that's closest to me. <clears throat> Eighteen. To hit. Eighteen wet. Fourteen damage. And that's uh, 21 to hit. 15 damage. Sweet. Um, Joe <clears throat> does make an active attempt to step back. Um, <laughs> and enough. for his bonus action, shouts, Something big is coming! <laughs> Something big this way comes! Yeah. Oh, shit. Um... And then we'll fire his three magic missiles at uh, this one. It's three. That's five. That's three. Ailey. Alright. This one again. Sweet. Uh, yes. Yay! Wasn't sure if it would be. Cool. Um, you managed to place this arrow perfectly in what would be, uh, what could be called its spinal column, um, and it clumps yes. into the ground. Uh, 
Willie. All righty. Um, I guess I'll try to start smacking the other one. Sweet. <laughs> So fifth, uh, oh Jesus! Um, Fourteen to hit. Hits. Yeah, that will hits. Um, and seventeen damage. Seventeen damage. Sweet. Second swing does thirteen. Cool. Crumple that one too. Nice. Um, nice. See. Get the fuck out of here. There's still a whole lot of rumbling, Gracus. <laughs> Uh, we're still running for the exit, right? I guess so. Was that the plan? We yeah, were trying sure. to get out and these guys pop up and I'm like, I don't want to be stuck here with whatever the fuck comes out. I mean, I feel like we kind of have to take, take out whatever's coming out, don't we? We're kind of the only ones that can. <laughs> we can attempt it on, on more even ground. We yeah, can, which will be speaking. outside. Yeah. I'm dying in a cave. Sure. <laughs> Got some PTSD there. At least okay. it's not so, this time. You're going to make your... I don't say. And if yeah. it comes up around here, I'm fucked. Okay. So I'd say that's all of your bonus actions used for this round. Um, talking this out. <laughs> <laughs> Understandable. So if yeah, you're going to make well, your... I can't do anything anyway, so... Okay, so you're gonna make your full dash, sixty feet. There, there, right. The, the yep. shit. things are in the way. That was, that was one sideways. Yep. How long does your thing last? I uh, slice spray or no, this ten minutes. It's concentration. And hit. So. Cool. Uh, I can break my concentration if it. You can choose to drop it if you want. Yep. Otherwise, Lana's going to. Do I have, have to do that on my turn? No, you can do it now. So, yeah, there's, there's if no you guys want to make a that. dash for it, I can drop it. It's up okay. to you. I'm running either way. You I don't have really short have... legs. I need to get ahead. Yeah. So, you dropping yeah, it? I'll, I'll drop it. Sweet. Drop. Drop it when it's dashed. Starts to fall away. Lana can make. Well, she's not going to actually run her full distance. She's just going to run over here. Um, and then. Rumble comes to its crescendo. You, something Lana. bursts through the ground. Sure, I wouldn't have done that if Lana was fucking. What? <laughs> If I knew it was just going to be Lana, I would have just left it. Yeah. <laughs> and Lana didn't even run properly. Oh, good lord. Is that an ant? Christ. So. Are you fucking kidding me? Bursting. Fucking ki in a fucking <laughs> cave. You're not in a cave. A mine, and it's not an ant, really. You're not in a. And it's not a. It's not an ant. It's not an ant. It is a. It is a giant. <laughs> It is a, it is like a giant lizardy thing, um, is it? But it's got lots of legs, um, and a long tail. Um, it, it, uh, Ailey, I guess, um, will it's know. Scientifically distinct from yeah, an ant. Yep, yeah. Ailey will know this. Uh, will, will know it for, for, will for, see it familiar in shape to a behir. Um, but it is, it is definitely a construct of some sort. It seems to have, it seems to have, uh, been a constructed oh. beer. Ailey, what the fuck is a beer? La, 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 la. <laughs> <laughs> um, Varys, you're up. Yeah, I'll, I guess I'll, I am. I'll add this to the... That's unfortunate. Oh, oh, really um, low. So, I'm gonna go for a 
dazing shot on it. Okay. That's that there. Um, I'm taking a shot. Twenty-two. That'll hit. Um, so it's going to make a con save and beat uh, DC fourteen. DC fourteen on a con save. Uh, yep. It beats it's it. Making, uh, it does not make it, so that's on disadvantage. Nice. Cool. Aha. Right. Bearing in mind, the rumbling has not stopped, and it has just no, listened, no. so um, you've also got your next. Yep. Um, no, no grip points spent on this one, just a regular. Yeah, that'll hit. hit 22 piercing. Knocks off some armor. Oh, um, I'm also going to move a little bit further away from it. See, Joe's going to use his last, third, last second level spell to throw some more scorching rays at it. First one misses, second one hits, third one hits. 18 damage. Ellie. Okay. Well, I guess. So, you know, whatever this thing is, it probably is going to have a lightning based attack based on what you know of Bahir. <laughs> <laughs> what is Bahir? <laughs> Tell us. You don't know what it is. No. In general, nope. like they won't. None of them would know what it is. No, you know that it's like and a. I, would I know that they wouldn't know what it is, and that I would? <laughs> <laughs> like, would Ailey be like, oh, I should probably warn them, or? I mean, you don't know exactly what it is. You just know that it's constructed in a sim to to be a facsimile of something. Um, so you you will you can you will assume that it's probably got similar abilities to what thing is that it's imitating um yeah. but yeah you 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 probably imagine that that they're a little all as much in the dark about it as, as you would you as a human would be so yeah. in that case Ailey would shoot it first okay and be like uh for their bonus probably like by the way this <laughs> might have electric attacks not sure but maybe cool well you miss <laughs> willie ferris looks down at the metal gun in his hand oh <laughs> fuck i don't know what the radius um, would be though you know, gonna, it'll shoot it'll just char charge at it. you know it'll be shooting the straight line <laughs> willie's well, charging straight charge. at it don't say charge right now. <laughs> Sweet. What's the what's the plan? Swing. Swing. Swing better, better swing. Um, swing, swing from the tables off. Uh, that one. Oof. Not eleven. They all miss. What about 16? 16 will... miss. Now. Thoracus. Ah! Okay. Um... Slayer's Bram. Slayer's Bram. Attempt my longbow. Sweet. Mm -hmm. Doesn't hit. Is that? That one does. Alright. So. 17 so, damage. 17 damage. Nice. Cool. What is its turn? Okay. Will a 15 hit? 
Willie? Me, me. Uh, it certainly will. Cool. Uh, um, you will take. Uh, 16 bludgeoning damage, half day. Mm-hmm. Uh, plus. What you hear, a plus? Uh, 20 half to 10. Wow. Slashing Jesus. damage. I don't know if we need uh, pluses on this. Um, and please make a strength saving throw. Uh-huh. As it has whipped out its tail, oh. and it has grabbed you, uh. and you are currently grappled, strained. Well, oh, strained. Uh, grappled or restrained? Both. It's a big oh. tail. <laughs> oh dear. Oh, that's not good. Uh, uh, but you'll be able to break free. Try and break free every time. Um, sweet. Uh, Lana is going to. <laughs> How is this Lana's fault? It's always Lana's fault. <laughs> she Lana's had been a... all like, oh, I gotta go around the thorns. I would have <laughs> dropped it and we would have had something up on the field. I mean, it wouldn't be. It wouldn't be in it. <laughs> It's off to the side. Oh, yeah. It would have been infuriatingly yeah, close to it. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> Just to ruin you. Would have uh, been between me and it, and that would have felt good. That's true. <laughs> There's a lot of safety in that. 3d10. Yeah. 21 is to make a wisdom saving throw. It's not to get bonuses for that. That's not what I wanted. Not a D10, D20. Oh man, I didn't think it fails that. Nice. Right, Lana deals 21 passive damage to it without even trying. Nice. Um, and then makes a guiding bolt on it. Hits. Nine. Um, and the next attack on it will have advantage. So, Varus. Advantage, you say? Yes. Wonderful. I'm going to make this a violent shot, then. Sweet. That's my other grip gone. And as she fires a bright white light at it, striking into the side, making it glow faintly around the outside, allowing your attacks to uh, have a good good sight on it. Oh, I thought I, uh... That's bright light. I, I did. Oh. Oh no, 14. That doesn't hit. That does not hit. Thankfully it wasn't the 7, though, because that, uh... would have broken the gun. Um, mm -hmm. uh, so that uses up the advantage, yes? That will use or up no. your advantage, yeah. Okay. It's just the, that's the next attack roll meant against him. Okay. Uh... And you used a violent and... shot on that, didn't you? Fuck it, just shoot it again. Hey! Oh, fuck, do it again. Holy shit! <laughs> what the fuck? Hell yeah. <laughs> Alright, 25 damage. Not, not oh. quite max yeah. damage, but pretty much. Nothing to sneeze at. <laughs> no, definitely not. It's only two off max damage. Alright. Uh, and I have less bullets now. Yeah, it's my turn. I was gonna just fucking magic missiles it again. Where is it? Huh. Interesting. Don't know what that's all about. It's rolling. It's showing that it's rolling two d4s when I see the dice, but it's not in the calculations. Mm. Interesting. Um, it's two. It's four. It's two. Ailey. Um, he's 
fucking moved in the way, but uh <laughs> Ailey will probably be trying to get a little bit closer, but not too close. You know, close close enough in case desperate times calls for desperate measures. Okay. Is it looking worse for wear yet or we can't tell? You can't really tell. There's definitely been some metal like pried off of it. You do not get sneak attack because um Lily's restrained. So just uh, nine piercing damage. Damn. Oh, fuck. Oh, yeah, because Lana's not quite close enough. He's just that little bit too far away. Yeah, she couldn't get close enough. She didn't have enough movement. All right, Willie, make your uh, strength saving throw again. Willie? Nope. Thrax. I googled and hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. <laughs> oh, you're a raging, so you would get uh, advantage on that, yeah. Well, no, not so much that. I was more just googled restraint to. So restraint means mm -hmm. you get zero speed. Yeah. Uh, and that's about it. The creature just. Okay, so you can still attack. Throws, and grappled means attack rolls are at disadvantage. Okay. So you can make some regular attack rolls then. Hey, exactly. <laughs> regular old attack rolls. <laughs> regular rolls. Yeah. Regular rolls. <laughs> Fucking regular rolls. <laughs> Alright, miss. And miss. Alright, guys. Regular rolls. Regular rolls. Regular rolls. <laughs> oh, my lord. Bringing it back. <laughs> up slightly so I don't hit Lana. Um, I mean, you don't really care at this point, do you? Well, it'd be a shame <laughs> if I didn't get a hit on the. That's true. Head. That's a good point. Because of her giant fucking head was in the way. Okay. <laughs> uh, that won't hit. Next. And that won't hit either. <laughs> cool. Sorry. What a conscience. Mm. Nom 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 nom. <laughs> so is noise is the makes. Willy? Um sixteen will hit you, won't it, Willie? <laughs> uh, unfortunately, yes. <laughs> yep. So I thought it was all muted. That's fine. Uh, plus six. Oh, so that's let's pull out the calculator. Six divided by two. Um, all right, so ten total piercing damage. Is that halved? Yeah, it's halved from twenty-one. All right, and. and and um it has swallowed you <clears throat> oh. it has, um, reached down and pulled you in um while swallowed the town good is blinded from strained it is total cover against text and other things outside of it that's fine there's nothing else inside of you hit it without yeah, without it hitting you. him yeah um you take 66 acid damage at the beginning of each one of its turns, so you forget this turn. Similar thing um, I'm in danger! <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh no. Alright, so um, Hey, can't, can't think of a better guy to get swallowed. Mm -hmm. Then why? Oh dear. <laughs> a dick joke. <laughs> It was, yes. <laughs> but, <laughs> but it was also literally you were the only person that would probably survive that. Yeah. Wait. Um, and there we'll end this turn. Um, yeah. <laughs> what the fuck is Lana going to do? Is there something good? Uh, 
Uh, oh, wait, it does turn on there, so it's going to take another 3 d8. Make it to wisdom saving throw. Does not. So it's taking another 12 damage. Um. Sweet. So she's gonna fucking fucking God damn it. She's gonna summon a spiritual weapon. Can do some stuff. Yeah, she's gonna do some stuff. Some stuff and some things. Some stuff and some things. Summon a spiritual weapon. It's like a giant little shieldy thing. Um, I've made it pure white light. Um, and we'll swing at it, and we'll fucking miss. But she can do that every turn. It's a bonus action, so. Maris. Well. See the rumbling the, uh, under the ground has um, started to uh, get quite, quite, quite a lot again. Can I? Do I have any idea of direction, or is it, it is like coming all straight, around straight point? down? I feel it. Okay. And feel it coming through trees. Uh, can I move over here so I'm closer to the group? Okay. Um, <clears throat> And I'm gonna take some shots on this fucking thing and hope that I can kill it before it eats Willy and consumes him whole. Sweet. 23 damage off uh, 25 to hit. Cool. It, uh. And its death rose, as you've clearly pierced some sort of line in it, and like what seems like an oily substance spurts out from, from both sides of it as your fucking massive bolt just shoots right through it. <laughs> and it starts and then throws Willy up onto the ground. He is currently prone um, but then falls down dead. Um, but stuff is the ground is still rumbling. Welcome back to the land of not being swallowed by bug things. Let's keep going. Dex. <laughs> I none of us are really capable of dragging him. I don't think that. <laughs> I'm just sure wrong. Multiple. Multiple. Uh, I mean, magic. Two. I can go like another three. So it's In five. any case, the ground is still a rumbling. Yep. Yep. Our turn order is still active. Yep. Joe. Get a move Let's on, Joe. Make this full. 60. Ailey. Wait, what? Are we shooting at this? What are we, are we just trying mm. to run? Just trying to run. The ground's still right. rumbling, nope. something's still coming. You need to get to the bottom of the screen. The bottom. Yeah, so, like, to get out of the, there. to get out of the, uh... Get In this direction. The, okay. the I'm gonna use my dash so that I can run 60. Yep. Is that, like, there? Yep. Mm-hmm. Um, and was that it, or do I get another? I mean, you can dash as a bonus, so you get a full action. So I so, can... You can take a drink of some healing potion, you can do spells, whatever. I can't see anything to do that. No. Um... All you hear is the ground of rumbling. I mean, 
I don't trust that the invisibility potion would actually work um, against whatever this is. So, yep, Ailey's just gonna, yeah. So that's as far as I can run, right? Can't yep. use anything to run further. Yep. So, Willie, you're scratching again, but um, you use half your movement to get up um, from your prone state. Um, what do you want to do with the rest of it? Um, and then I will dash, I guess. So, so half my movement is currently 20. Mm -hmm. And so then I will dash to 60 total. Is that you? Does that right? Yeah, yeah, you'd have 20 left over and then 40 for your full movement. Yeah. Yeah. So where does that put me? Um, just put yourself at the edge of the screen. Yeah. Ooh. Not there. Yeah, that's close enough. <laughs> All right. Now I'm just gonna uh, get the fuck out of there. Run yourself down as well. Did Ferris? Mm. Did we skip over a Thoracus? Oh yeah, I guess we did. What did that happen? Oh yeah, Thoracus. Before Lana. Yeah, I can make, make it, it to the edge. See? Cod Swallop, I presume? With Cod Swallop. So you can go further than me. Oh, yep. yeah. He's running with He's you. He's bounding ahead of us. Yeah. Sweet. Varys. Like, you're coming with. Yeah. I'm pretty sure I've got 25, so I can get 50. Yeah, I can get off. Yeah. Sweet. Hey, you can get off. <laughs> More of them. Wonderful. Cool. And just as you start to get out and it moves into Joe's turn. Another one blasts out of the ground. The rumbling stops. The day has been a long day. Joe spins around. And uh, you hear you hear the come out of him in that in that kind of deeper way, the strained way. Um, flicks his hands around, and yeah, like a Kamehameha wave. Oh yes! And gets a fucking natural twenty. <laughs> oh, good shit. On his fucking. My boy Joe. <laughs> Lightning bolt. Where does that even where did that even show that doesn't even show up on my screen? Something's weird here. I don't think that he even needed an attack throw. No. <laughs> it didn't need an attack throw, but he, he, he threw one anyway. Did it anyway. Um But he zaps him for thirty-six damage. Or thirty-six lightning. Um, seemingly not doing any damage, actually, but, um, then he, uh, he seems to do something else, um, waving his hands around a little bit more and seems to expend some sort of energy, um, infusing it into himself again, and then cast lightning bolt one more time. <laughs> Joe, I think maybe you do not use lightning bolt. Does not seem to be helping. Um, and overcharges the <laughs> clockwork be here, and it fucking explodes. Oh my god! <laughs> Never mind. I take it back. You did a great job. Spending all of his all of his level three. We see all of his level three spell slots and some of his sorcery points. Damn. To get that off. Well, hope we don't run into anything else. Well, the rumbling did stop, I believe. Yeah, the rumbling has has seemed to have ceased for now. Fuck out of here. Um, so we can turn it off for now. With this. Cool. So you you're leaving? <laughs> yep. Yeah. yeah. Why did they blame elves for this? I'm confused. They didn't know what happens. The mind, the the stuff that's being mined here, um, supposedly, um, 
is a uh, is a magical material, the spice. Yeah. And they had a war the over it. Menage. So they think that um, they think that the that maybe they've attacked this place to steal some some spice. Let the spice flow. Yeah. Um. <laughs> So, there's also the other make your way out the gate. Yep. So run your way out the gate. The behemoth, whatever it's called, head to be like, this is the what attacks. But here? Well, most of you have run out the gate. Um, Joe has, you know, shot the thing with his two lightning bolts, blowing it up. Um, mm. There's another one there yeah, that is, yeah, that is like shot through. It's quite large. Um, you certainly try. To try and pry its head off or a limb or something. Something that I can get. Okay. Well, Roland. Fuck. <laughs> um. <laughs> what are you gonna Roland roll? Just member <laughs> no, it's mechanical. <laughs> so, uh, uh. So not strength? Probably intelligence. Um. <laughs> my thieves tools? <laughs> to call, yeah. yeah, actually, yeah. Roll a, roll a, roll a, roll a thieves tool. With dexterity? Yep. Yeah, no, you, you're not going to get anything off of that. Yeah. Well, not quickly. Little anyway. one! You. Little one! You do the tinker! You, Who the you, fuck are you, you talking to? What? You, the little I have, one! I, I have a name! You did it! <laughs> Say my name and I might do it. Moon, come, fix. That's only even part of my last name. <laughs> you didn't even say my first name at all. You didn't I'm even just the name. that Ailey is struggling with Varus's name because it's not like, you know, like Therikus is fine. <laughs> <laughs> but Varus's name is not because of whatever reason. Uh, <laughs> Too many V's. Language barrier. Mm. This sounds. His name is spelled the same in Halfling as it is in Common. Yep. <laughs> yeah, that doesn't mean Ailey doesn't struggle to say it. <laughs> <laughs> uh... Oh dear. <laughs> um, Ailey would probably say Halfling in Draconic, which just sounds like a bunch of like. Ah, ah, ah. <laughs> like yeah. <laughs> Metal screaming band, you know. Metal. Really gave up on on hiding things, huh? Mm -hmm. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> going through languages. <laughs> Just going through all the languages, she does. <laughs> She'll be like, ah, oh. the spies. So what? What is the plan? It says halfling and thieves count as well. <laughs> Amazing. I mean, that just sounded like an insult. <laughs> Pretty sure you called me a slur of some kind. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear. Ailey gives up with Varus and goes, Therikus, <laughs> do you want Jamie to be allowed to leave the house again? Do you want to prove Jamie's innocence? I mean, I'm kind of hoping she's not the most innocent, but uh, yes. <laughs> <laughs> Varys, Varys walks past, and you just hear from in the back of your head, "Nice, <laughs> <laughs> nice." <laughs> Entirely different accent. <laughs> nice, <laughs> nice, <laughs> nice. <laughs> He can, he can change his accent when he talks in people's heads. Yep, exactly. <laughs> he can do whatever he wants. Yeah, I don't want people slandering her. Alright, so yeah, you're going to try? It's good if she was actually... Um, but... Alright, well, um... I mean, roll a nature check. Let's see. Yeah. It's not, it's, not really, it's not really the right thing for this, but we'll see what happens. Alright! Sweet! Okay. Um... You've dealt with enough of this bullshit now. <laughs> well, you're familiar enough with, um, of animal anatomy, and this is a, vex a facsimile of an animal. Um, so you find it's, you find the right places where, where joints would naturally be, and where, you know, it's, 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 
the the material is is interesting so the other clockworks are normally made entirely out of metal um but this one like has like a a leathery interior um it's like it's it it, it is it's not flesh it's not like and so it's not metal over a flesh sack yeah it is like metal over a flesh sack um oh, okay. but the the the, the flesh it's isn't not- it's not flesh though it's not it's not like it's like a, flesh. it's not animal flesh it is it is like plasticky material um leathery synthesized, synthesized flesh um and you you know you cut through it uh, nicely enough um to get off uh, the head of the one that's still intact um it's quite large um okay let's find out how much how much it would weigh Uh, uh, uh. Look, I don't know how pounds work. Oh, I've got <laughs> <laughs> yeah, um, two point two pounds to the kg. Yeah. <laughs> That's yes. not helpful. <laughs> um, I mean, it's metal as well, so it's about a hundred pounds. So, you probably won't be able to carry it with your carry weight. Twenty kg. Yeah. So. Are there any Between carts? us, can we, or do we just convince <laughs> Willie to carry it? Uh, are there any carts around or anything? Yeah, there's some of the chicken mean, carts in the mine. street. We can take some cart. We can take a cart. Yeah. Turn spawn from a cart. Okay. Um. So you want to? Well, you, you saw some carts. Um. So you, who wants to go for the cart? There's like one around the corner. Yeah, I'll go for it. Okay. <laughs> so you get there. There's an overturned cart. Um. Do you want to try and try and <laughs> turn it up right? Oh, <laughs> I get. I get there and I say, ah, this is not the job for me. <laughs> I turn around and I go back. <laughs> All right. I'll give so, it a go. So you roll, roll a strength check. Uh, did that not? Uh, Has it gone through? No. It's, it's way there we go. go. The yeah. highest of highs. Afraid no. It's the lowest of lows. Afraid oh, not. The lowest. The sum. No, that is very lucky. Yeah. <laughs> so the cart is, um, you know, it's like a horse-drawn cart, but it's not It's not as big as, like, the carriages you've been moving into. Like, it could be pulled by a pony or, or, or a mule. Um, or a, it is, or it a is like Or a barbarian. Um, it is enclosed. Yeah, pony. Um, so <laughs> it, it seems to be, it seems to be filled with something. Um, and that's probably why it's a bit hard for you to lift. Ask for help. Get a get a fun of friend. <laughs> <laughs> she gonna get the barbarian to try and pick it up, or what's what's the plan, plan here? You gonna look in it, or what's Willie, what's the deal? Could you please assist with this vehicle? Yeah. <laughs> All right. Strike check from Willie. Uh, it's a mm, Come on. You're afraid not. <laughs> you also attempt to pick it up um, off, 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 off of the side, and it is, it is just. It's not your day, you know. You just got swallowed. You, you. Know, not feeling the greatest, um, coming down off <laughs> some civ- serious <laughs> ridge. Yeah, you have a puff and you, uh, yeah, you, you, try, you try to get it up and you it almost gets there and it falls back down. Um, yeah, it is filled with something that has made it I quite a bit heavier. investigate to see what the something is. Sweet. Go, go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Cool. Uh, 
Yeah. So you, uh, you know, you peer in through it, um, through like the cracks in it have appeared. Um, you can see some sacks inside. Um, it's probably filled with whatever they're mining here. Mm. Pretty stocked with it. Mm. Really, a... are you able to carry the head? How uh, heavy is it? 100 pounds, please. Yeah. How big is it? Like, it would not in terms fit, of, like, it would not fit in your um, sack, of holding. sack of holding now. Lame. <laughs> yeah. um, sure. So, in your investigation of the cart, you do see that there is an opening, but it's on the side that's currently pressed into the ground. But if someone. Ah. Could, Lift it and, I, and open it up. Can I assist somebody to lift this? Because I can't See? fucking lift it. So if you really roll another strength check at this time with advantage. Yeet. Even <laughs> 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 So much for assisting things. Oh my god. <laughs> uh, can, we, can we do a group effort here? <laughs> Like okay. Like Alright, sweet. Every, everyone, so Varus, Voodoo, and Thoracus all try. <laughs> all roll a straight check at once. Um, yeah. Help later. <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> this is why I don't do it, man. Alright, and, like and Voodoo, way. not an advantage. Except I, I'm a dumb. You're a dumb. I can re roll that. You can re roll that. Uh, what am I? Uh, advantage? No advantage. Oh. <laughs> Sorry, no, no advantage. No advantage on this one. <laughs> That's a save. That's a save, not a check. That's a save, it's different. There we go. Okay. So after many attempts of you all trying desperately to get this up, eventually <laughs> Willie just fucking just... <laughs> just fucking yeets the whole thing up it like flies up a few meters and then drops back down perfectly on its wheels and you hear the like the after after a few times of dropping it directly on Varus's feet yeah it's now perfectly upright um <laughs> yeah. and from and from landing and in, in like moving around a little bit like the doors opened as well so you can see inside of it Two fucking zero. That's fucking fantastic. It's horrible. Um, so what's inside now that we can actually look at it properly? So those sacks are one hundred percent full of that spice material. Um, it is, um, it's like a white powder. Um, but it like sparkles. Um, and the light, so it's like oh. it's like fine like, crystals. I was like, would be ignoring it, but as soon as you said it sparkles, yeah, uh, it's like it's it's like very very fine crystal. Um, mm. but the 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 light that it reflects doesn't it doesn't seem like it like a rainbow effect or anything. It's not like it's not like when you um when you put light up against a diamond or a gem or anything like that. It is. It is like it's like it's producing that light uh. when you when you sprinkle it. Mm. Well, uh, can we sort of shift the how how full is it? Um, you can fit the head in there for sure. Okay, can we sort of like shove the the sacks underneath like benches or something? sort of out of the way so you want to you want to leave them in there or do you want to take them out and put them somewhere no i want to leave them in there okay so you can like yeah you can push them to the sides put the head in there mm. and then there'd be enough room for one person or or a halfling and a dog um well, the dog can go in there i'll jump up the top my usual spot my gun see it's not really going to be a this is not really going to fit everybody on it. It's the problem. So you're not going to be moving very fast anyway. Mm. Sweet. What's the plan? You're just going to leave town with this or? Guess so. Sweet. Well, um, 
Joe offers to take turns with Willie pulling the cart. <laughs> nice. Um, <laughs> Very kind. She is capable of that. Um, you make your way through, through back through the town. Um, yeah, no rumbling. Um, you're listening out for it very keenly. Um, yeah. A lot of the fires. I feel like we'd be would be familiar with it by now. Yeah, a lot of the fires seem to have um, kind of died down. There's still smoke pillowing out, but you don't hear the the crackling, crackling of of flames. Um, and there's a nice. It seems to be a nice storm cloud approaching from the uh, from the east. Um, it's probably bringing with it some heavy snow and rain. Um, so it's probably going to sort this place right out. Um, so you're not too concerned about it, um, but you also don't care if this place whole place burns down, considering what happened. <laughs> Considering, yeah, uh, nearly died again. Yep. One of our friends did. Yep. And then you make your way back down through the snowy bits. You know, you struggle a little bit with the um with the cart, um, but you know, you push through with both Willie and Joe pushing it. Um, hey, you yeah, make it to the uh to the bridge um, on the river where the guards were um mm -hmm. the guard who you um had seen at um midday was no longer there um seems to be another another thing of people mm. halt who goes there Hail. we are mercenaries we were sent in to deal with the problems in the town oh well, uh, you weren't you weren't informed. The man that was here before he told us about you know people having things come up from the ground and oh, I was aware of death and I was aware of what's been happening up there. I wasn't aware that we had we had mercenaries paid to send anybody up there. But um, fabulous. Mm. I, I guess you come back successful then. Yes, uh, will you show them that head? Sure. So, so you uh, yeah. Open the door of the uh, of the cart. Peers in. Oh, yes. what is that? It's door. not like it's it not like any like fleshy thing I've ever seen before. No, it is not even fleshy thing. It is a mechanical thing. Um, Interesting. There were a couple of them and some weird other thing. Weird but, other uh, thing. The, yeah, well. Also construct in nature, but different. You know, more uh, bipedal, not many, many legs. Hmm. Okay. But yes. Um, Very interesting. Well, um, I think I need tissues. There appears okay. to be no more rumbling. Um, rumbling. We believe that we have. There was a rumbling. That was a warning that they were going to come up through the ground. Oh. That was how they attacked. Okay. As far as I am aware, uh, there was no more of that as we left. That's well, good to hear. Um, I'll be bringing that information to my superiors, but I'm sure you'll make it in there and tell everyone about what's going on anyway. So mm. we are I know a lot of people. Yeah, sweet. I know a lot of people have been uh, spreading a lot of rumors about what's been going on up there, but um, I'm glad someone sorted it out. Thank, thank you I'm guys a lot. I'm glad that we can get to the heart of this issue. Anyway. Yeah. Mm. Well, good, good day to you. Good fortune to you. Sweet. As they, as they get down the road, Varus wipes a little bit of sweat off his brow. As long as he doesn't say anything about that spice, we'll be all good. <laughs> Wait, so did you actually take the spice? Yeah, yep. you got a, you got a half a, a cart full of spice. Oh, dear. all right, and you make your way back to Rogan. The spice melange. Spice melange. <laughs> oh, you make your way um, down the north Wait, road. Oh. Um, uh, it is I believe getting, that we hit the ambassador's building first. It is getting um, getting pretty late as you approach. Oh, okay. We also <laughs> need somewhere that we can store the cart, and I, I don't imagine that the 
Yes. Well, I imagine that the uh, ambassador's area would probably have a stable of some sort. Maybe. We're trying to prove they weren't stealing the spice, and you're about to bring a cartload of stolen spice to the ambassador's house. I did not think of it this way. <laughs> Varys is going to look down towards the Rikers. <laughs> so, uh, what do you think about this? The Rikers? what? <laughs> uh, maybe Haley pointed out that we are trying to prove that Jamie's people aren't stealing the spice and didn't attack the town, but that we've come back with a cart full of stolen spice. That's my And we're taking it to the ambassador's house. <laughs> stolen spice. This is liberated spice. <laughs> it is the first among the shipments after the attacks were curtailed. There we go. She really missed a lot. Like, <laughs> oh, Apparently. <laughs> oh, well, none of us are elves, so I don't think we're going to be suspected of... of... Lana is half-elf. Oh, fuck. <laughs> I know you fuck. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh, yeah, did we get spice for the head? When did we not have the head? Oh, no. We, you have we the still head. have the head. We have the head and spice. Yeah. You put it in the cart with the spice. So there's, you got half a cart of spice, and half, half a cart of a dog, and a, and a big bear head. At some point during the journey, um,. I believe Ailey probably would have pocketed some of the spice in okay. one of their spare brewing bottles. Sweet, so have a brewing bottle of spice. Why the hell yeah. did we put the spice in a really obvious open place when we've got a bag of holding? Spice is in there big, of, spice is in big a, bags. You got half, half a cart and cartload. Fucking crap. the hell did we accept the spice? Seemed like a bad idea. Uh, the spice was just still in the cart. Yeah. When you we just it shuffled it around to make room for the head. The hell did yeah. we leave spice in the cup? It is a magical essence. It's probably very valuable. Yeah, and it's going to get us in a lot of shit. That's Could what do. Ailey was saying. <laughs> and so of course the, the, Ailey would have the bags were all closed up for travel. Is. The guy might not know. We could be fine. But we should also probably just tell this to uh, Jamie and Wakelaw. So we should probably stash the spice elsewhere before going anywhere near Jamie. <laughs> okay. That's what but... I was trying to say. All right, so yes, we go I to Wake. I agree with Ailey. <laughs> okay. So we go to Wakeloff first, and we say, "Hey, uh, little problem." Spice. <laughs> okay. So <laughs> it is. It is we, getting late into the. It is song. getting late into the evening. Um. Last time you appro you came in at this time, um, Wayclaw was not around in this office. Um, you should probably find logic. Oh, didn't, didn't didn't he say that he was going to be? And he said that he was going to be he was going to be seeing Jamie at some points as well. Um, to continue because he's been he's been the way go between between the ambassador and the rest of the council. Yeah. Um, well, we just there cover is the one for now and take it to Jamie's where no one can see it. There is one place in the hide. city you know of that no one has ever been. Hmm? Oh, yeah! <laughs> the train! <laughs> Alright, let's do it. <laughs> let's fucking do stash it. Stash it on the train. No, stash it down in the area where the train is. Just yeah, because it was the like train. skips and an elevator and me and Joe took the elevator and everyone else took the steps. Yeah. So we can just put it in the elevator and push the elevator to go down. <laughs> well, there's like a so there's like a hidden door, um, yeah. that you guys yeah. have seen probably just yeah. Anyway, you make your way over there. Um, you open back up the like um, in the, way in the, the thing. Today. I will be keeping watch while yeah. people move the stuff. Yeah. Um. Yeah. At this time of night, there's no one really on the street. Um. At this this part of town, um, it's you know it's pretty slum like. Um, it's a bad, yeah, bad it's, neighborhood. It's all right, because um, I could cast darkness. You could do that as well, but people would probably notice that. 
also, I didn't know. <laughs> they wouldn't the... know we were there. That's magical darkness. Yeah, I think it is. That alters dark vision. It does. Like it also, yeah, it also means that none of down. you would be able to see yeah. through either. Yeah. yeah. But only it for, takes that, for that little thing. bubble, so. Anyway, yeah. you you open up the thing, you know, you're peering out to the side, make sure you're doing it pretty sneakily, um, and then you load, um, you just throw the sex in there, um, and then re put up the the hiding stuff that you've been you put up again and there you go spice is stored <laughs> headed away in the train station <laughs> hey we are oh, no we haven't even told wake law exactly what you haven't told him this yet either no, so nope. no we haven't it's, told no. where it is we just said we found anyone. it yeah yeah cool went to okay. next jamie's right jamie's yeah there's no point making an appointment for Wake or we'll just figure that out tomorrow, right? Well, I mean, I imagine that he'd arrive at some point to See? to the ambassador's places he has been the go-between. Yes. Cool. So you guys make your way to Jamie's. Um, <clears throat> Lana, um, once you guys approach, Lana uh, is hesitant. Um about entering um she says i um i think i need to uh to maybe go back to my um my temple and um and sort of talk through what uh, what i've been through with um with the priests there um mm -hmm. i'll leave uh, i'll leave rillin's name out of it for now um plan. Yeah. So um, you think that they will be accepting of this vision you saw in your death? I don't know. I don't know what they'll what they'll do. Um you know, I'm still faithful to uh to Thirith, but um I don't know what they'll what they'll say. If yeah. if it didn't if they believe me then uh, it'll definitely definitely spark some conversations and some some inner thought from them to figure out what's happening here, which is probably for the best, if if we can figure out what has caused this this problem? Okay. Um, definitely help us understand what maybe Rillen's going through, and some way to break whatever's happened to him. But um, mm. I've still got uh, I've still got the warnings around the around the town to know when um, when he or you guys approach. So I'll know when you're back, or if you leave. So, <laughs> and I know where you'll probably come. <laughs> Yes, exactly. <laughs> if you so. encounter any issues, you know where to find us. Yes. Thank you all so much for your help. Thank you as well. Be safe. Cool. She nods her head and turns away. So you guys continue to Jamie's knock on the door, get on the floor, everybody walk the dinosaur. Um, <clears throat> door opens um, after you know the, the the cacophony of of locks unlocking and wood being moved and uh, Izu puts, pokes his head in the door ah oh, it's just you lot alright get in yeah, nice to see you too <laughs> yes yeah, nice to see you too <laughs> oh jeez what have you got you got a fucking car, uh, so what the fuck? <laughs> yes, uh, it uh, contains evidence of the fact that it wasn't the elves that were attacking in that town. I see. What sort of evidence are we town? talking? A uh, giant metal head. Ah, cool. Yeah, uh, pain in the ass. It nearly <laughs> ate Willy. Well, oh, sorry, it. sorry. <laughs> it did eat Willy. It nearly digested him. It managed to eat him. Yes. That Holy is how shit! <laughs> yeah, right. Yes. How do you think? Jaws how, do you, like, fuck. how do you think I felt? That thing was huge. Fuck. I am like breath mint afterwards. <laughs> mm, minty fresh. <laughs> okay. Well, uh, I don't really want to bring it in through this door. Um, hold on a second. Um, he like steps through the door and closes it behind him follow me takes you around the corner 
um, oh. around, around the side. And there's sort of a, it's not really a courtyard. Um, there's, you get to go through the back door. Yeah, there's sort of a, a sort of an alley sort of thing. And then there's like a, um, a big opening set of doors that open into um, kind of like a garage, I guess. <laughs> um, just a, just a sort of a, a it would be oh, kind oh, of, oh. could be like a stable, stably area. Um, but it's, you know, it's got the, the carriage that he originally arrived in on in it um and room for the for the cart you push it up and in, into the into that space close the doors behind you he locks them come back around the front enter back in everyone gets in closes all the locks waves his hand my all seal and, and all that sort of magical shit um and you're into and you know you're back into the into the main area of of, of the ambassador's quarters um and Ailey not, not Ailey Jamie comes down the uh comes down the stairs to greet you oh you're back it's it hasn't been too long what uh what did you get up to <laughs> so we have I think some... the Rikish should tell the story <laughs> No. Oh, you me? Kicks Varus. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Varus sails a foot through the air. Please do it. doesn't know their strength. <laughs> uh, at least they uh -huh. didn't get eaten today. Hmm. Yeah. Uh -huh. So. So remember, we, be like we a can tree. Play, play again, uh, in regards to the mining town. Just, okay. Uh, lovely, strong Willie and, and Joe managed to get a uh, large contraption's head. That we, we had to construct. That's yeah. the word. Thank you. That's all right. <laughs> Have you told Jesus? Um, <laughs> I didn't do it. <laughs> Jamie's Don't blame just... me. I'm your wingman and not your person that forces you to speak in public occasions. <laughs> Jamie's yeah. just beaming, smiling at you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh! You should mention the part where you know you were the one that perfectly separated the head from the body. Which yeah, I wouldn't say perfect. I just I would say it was as me. good as you could fucking get. <laughs> You could, in fact, not have done better. I suppose you could say that. <laughs> I do say that. Okay, alright. <laughs> um, in any case, there were um, two of these very large things that um, had some pretty impressive ability, and there were a couple of uh, smaller constructs um, were black and and black to be yeah black interesting um, and, I've never and seen black ones before had previously happened to the miners okay and you've you've got a head of the one of the big things then you force yes. would you like to examine it I, I don't think that's necessary right now um it's very late um and I assume Izu, you put it in the in the garage. <laughs> yes, yes, we did. In the garage <laughs> with the ca um, with the garage. <laughs> yes. Garage in the garage. Yes, I did. Well, um, yeah, I, I guess we'll. I know that uh, Waycall is going to come over tomorrow morning. Um, oh. He said yep. he had um, had something he needed to tell me. Um, some this yeah there's going to be a council meeting um there's, i think there's one happening right now uh there's a late one so he's going to come over first thing in the morning tell me how it went um so it'll probably be best to give him the head um so that he can prove to the council that there's nothing that i have nothing that we have done um that it is all all the work of these these uh constructs um yeah there uh maybe yeah 
Okay. Some not so great news. Mm -hmm. uh, the cart that we used to transport uh, said head uh, from the town because it was a very large head. We couldn't carry it mm -hmm. all that way. Um, the cart in question might have happened to have had some spice upon it. Oh, <laughs> yeah. I see. Did you did you by chance bring the spice with you? Oh, uh, no, no, not not here. No, absolutely oh. not. It is no longer in the cart. Well, that's fine. I'm sure that can be explained. You know, you needed something to transport the head, and it's fine. I understand. I'm sure we all understand. You know, it's not it's not so much the means by which you've collected this head. Um, you know, it is. But, but the fact we did. Yes, exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah we totally, totally did a good thing. Uh, Jimmy's very I smart. I see why Therakis likes you so much. <laughs> yes, I'm sure. Um, also... Also? Hmm? We have... Something else happened. Something else. That, uh, oh yes, where is your uh, where... your half elfin friend? Hmm. She is. Hey, where the fuck is Lana? Where did she go? She is headed back to the she chicken church. Yes, yes, sorry. Um, <laughs> <laughs> you forgot. It... Uh, well, it definitely has to do with her. So, found Rillin. Oh, uh, good news? Unfortunately not. Um, oh. So what, what has become of him? He is... Nothing good. Yeah. Oh no. He seems to be practicing necromancy now. Oh. Oh. Not... Well, he attacked us. Oh. Yes. Including... Gee. A zombie dragon. Zom zombie dragon? He, he summoned an undead. A, yes, an undead dragon. Rotty. I see. The type of the type of creature you spoke of that the yeah. kobold was trying to become. Uh not one of those like actual, was it more like actual dragon? It was. Yeah, it was it was like a real It was like dragon. a like a small like a teen oh. dragon. Uh, like a young dragon. Like a young dragon. Like Juvenile yes. dragon that had been killed and become one. Yes. So more like actual dragon than the kobold was. Oh. I see. Um, Interesting. There's something like that had survived underground. He, that it, well, he also uh, remained. He, he, um, he also killed Lana. Then. Oh, no. Well, Resurrected her. Oh. Yes. Well. She saw. She thinks she saw what he saw that has uh, disturbed him so much to go to these lengths. Oh. Okay. What? What did, did she see? Her the same way. Um. It seemed to be infernal creatures <laughs> or creature. Okay. Who. who well, well, a creature that did speak to her in Infernal to welcome her. Okay. Um, they were all uh, stone statues, were they not? Yeah. And stone they said that there statues. was water. There was water lapping up towards their heads. There were people in front of her that she could see that were further beneath the waves of okay. whatever this liquid was. Was there? Was there a red? Sky? Guy and a dark sun. Yes, and sun. a black sun. Yes. Hmm. She said she that this very... is. Oh, sorry, carry on. She felt very strongly that this was not where she was supposed to be. No. When she died. That instead she was pulled there against the natural course of things. Yes. It is certainly. Certainly not where she was supposed to go. Hmm. I have heard of such a place, but it is not. 
it's not where spirits that I've not well, spirits that I've retrieved before have gone. Um, so I'm not too sh not f not sure exactly why uh, Rilin and, and Lana have have gone there when they tied. Um, she said something about perhaps it is this land itself that has done it. I mean, it's possible, but I mean, or something and, within it. I mean, my na my my nation is still part of this continent, so, and none of them have have ever none of them that I have returned have ever mentioned such things or or become so dark. Um, Perhaps it is because that these two people are not part of your your people that they found hmm. this. That is possible. She is half elf, right? Correct. Hmm. Raylan is a human. Yes. Um. Yes, I'm not sure. Um, all I know of about this place um, is that there was a there was a cult, a dark cult, um, that existed in my uh, well, in my people um, a long time ago. Um, they called themselves the Cult of the Dark Star. Um, they they believed that that was supposed to be with their their afterlife. Um, lunatics honestly i mean who would who would want to believe such a thing would be where you rest um i'll have to yeah i'll have to find out more um i'm not I, it was even before my time so i don't don't really know enough about it about it i just remember that that specifically i'll have to track down some some more information on it but i can't do that uh, here in the city um Maybe I'll get a chance to go back. Or maybe I can send you along with Izu to uh, to try and track it down. Either way, I think we are we are capable of doing that. Hmm. You are you have definitely proven yourself very capable. Hmm. <laughs> 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 Oh, Sorry, a little bit of spice went up my nose. <laughs> yes, very capable. Glad you think so. <coughs> oh dear. Well, now what? Go sleep. I suppose we have to wait till morning. Yeah, um, I can have the servants prepare you some dinner, and you can stay another night until, uh, until Wayclaw shows up. Only if we are not intruding. Oh, absolutely not. Very kind. Thank you. Um, yeah, I'll, I'll well go done, and get them prepared. Well done, your compliment. <laughs> <laughs> I am so proud of you. She walks off. I'm so private. And, uh, <laughs> yes, you are. You really there are. No there is no difference. <laughs> yeah. Uh, 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 yeah. Anyway, she takes uh, she takes you through to the kitchen, or to the to the dining area, and goes through to the kitchen, and orders you up some food. Uh, servants cook you up in a nice hearty meal of of steaks and. And fancy foods and fish, all that jazz. Um, you chow down, get nice and full bellied for going upstairs and crashing out for the night. Um, and it is uh, three to ten, so we will finish up here. Thank for the you. Night. Okay. Um, that's a perfect time to Got end it. Everybody. <sighs> Great right. right. session as Finished. level fives. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> we kick ass. You, yeah. you really, you really did. I was I expecting that. Yeah, I was expecting yeah. that to go a lot worse. <laughs> yeah. Only one of us was eating it. It's great. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> you know, only briefly. It. Only briefly. Yeah. It didn't even take acid damage. I know, right? Yeah. <laughs> well, it's a good thing because I was on one hit point. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> 
I should have been not, not good. We had a and That's cleric. why it took so long to get that card on her. Because yeah. mm. you, you were the only one strong enough and you were ever suffering. Mm. I think so, that in the end it was you just laughing at Varys, trying so hard and getting nowhere. You're like, fuck it! <laughs> I am a small man, I am not strong man. I shoot things well, I do not lift things. Your talents lie elsewhere. They do. <laughs> Alright. Thank you, Sweet. everyone. Yeah. Cheers. Cheers. Yeah. Um, cool beans. Um, yeah. yeah. Thanks, everybody. We're gonna finish up here. Um, tomorrow on the final channel we'll be playing no man's sky let's see on twitch and on youtube um friday and saturday random guy will be back with um something i'm not sure what he's playing at the moment um and then good old beef king salad will be back on sunday and then monday we'll be back with more Divinity Original Sin 2. Um, yep. And then Tuesday, Beef King Solo will be back um, with Day of the Tentacle. And then Wednesday, we'll be right back here seeing the aftermath of uh, the Stock and Spice. Go. <laughs> 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 uh, <laughs> oh, cool. Bye, everyone. Goodbye. Catch you guys later.